Boom, viewers, subscribers, back again with these quick updates because trust, if it's not foreign from King Mix Up, it's not credible. But keep on telling you that you don't know the thing said, people. Bless up on yourself on that throwback to us, yeah, but you know my style, I really one bag of one. You know, one that gave you to give you these daily updates on these people that you see in front of you. Andrew Hodnes, Harris Chang, Bert Samuels, Green Notice, and Major Anthony. I be a bag of bag of go on. You see me, I say, we already know them accused popcorn of being a cooking. And lock up for that. But before we get into any of that, people, major breaking news alert. Okay, people, breaking news. Dancehall artist, I'm, 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 art, dancehall empress Amari's children have been kidnapped um, by these black people. It's embarrassing. As you can see in post of you, she said, missing, please call NYPD. Or N or nine one one immediately. If you see my daughters, they have been sighted in Brooklyn and Bronx with a woman and a young man who are both involved in BLMC. You know what I mean? Or BLM or whatever. They have been recruited by them to give their loyalty to their causes and not the godly teachings of their parents, who they claim to be lost who they claim to be lost individuals despite what anyone may think no one has the right to indoctrinate my underage children and lure them to another city without my parental consent sincerely venice archong i'm on a lisa i'm on lisa she also said um her underage daughters were cited amongst these individuals. Please call 911 or NYPD immediately as they have been reported missing for over two weeks. Black Voice, whatever your organization will be brought to an attention of anyone. And all responsible parties will be held accountable. So that's a spread the, um, the word, you know. Hopefully these girls can come back safe to their mother. And things and things, you see, man, so many people. Channel. Well, people, it looked like Bro God is really Mr. Universe and help is on the way. You see, man, I say, Popcorn beg for help from Andrew Holness and Andrew Holness to the rescue. But before we get into that, people, let us update you on this lawyer and um, this JCF situation. You see, man, I say, because the lawyer asks for an apology um, from JCF from putting that statement about his client in a slanderous way. You see me, I say, and if you don't know, the press release released by the JCF on Wednesday um, said that Popcorn was convicted in Barbados for possession of marijuana and subsequently deported in Jam to Jamaica in 2009. And two years later, he was arrested in Barbados for possession of cocaine. The lawyer is asking for an apology to be made publicly. Um, he said that only charges were marijuana and those charges were expunged. And he is quoted saying he, Popcorn, has never been charged, tried, or arrested for cocaine in Barbados or any other country in the world. It is total falsehood. Um, you know, Popcorn was hit with a green notice because because of things arising in Barbados um, and he was held in immigration detention in the United Kingdom on Tuesday. You know what I mean? According to release, that green notice is generated um, by Interpol arising from arrest in Amting. The green notice was reconfirmed in Interpol in 2018. You know what I mean? Boy, oh boy, oh boy. And this is why Popcorn called on the Prime Minister Andrew Holness via social media after he was subjected to three and a half hours and things and things you see what i said but rasta nesta i even bought rasta robert nesta morgan said andrew honus has asked um his two security bosses to help popcorn he asked national security minister dr horace chang and commissioner of police major anthony to review the situation uh, with a view to help facilitate his ease to travel as an entertainer because you know these entertainers are an ambassadors you know um ja, ja. anyway people the lawyer said um actually the lawyer apologized for making 
an error in one of his statements on Twitter. First, he said JCF released cocaine charges in Barbados against PubCon is a falsehood and he said that his firm is filing um, legal charges by July 7th, you know. And then he said, correction, in my tweet, read JCF release on PubCon, I should have said, the release said he was arrested for cocaine and not that he was charged. I apologize for that earlier. So like I said in the earlier statement, he said that his client was neither charged or arrested for cocaine. So uh, I would like to see the outcome of this investigation from Rogard and his security bosses, is him. But before we go, Bert is stirring up a lot of controversy because he said this. I know they can put on the answer in the comment section. Do you believe Popcorn could have been arrested in Barbados in 2011 and no media house there of it in Jamaica ran with that story? Also, Google has nothing on that cooked up story at all. Jamaicans wise up and is, is, and is it fair to say a man was arrested for cocaine? Without more question marks, is my answer. So, like I said, um, maybe it's a case of mistaken identity, and Interpol got it wrong with Andre Sutherland. You know, then again, I don't know. Is my answer? May I wait for the um, the investigation to be thorough? But what do you think that Bert said? A lot of people saying Popcorn wasn't famous in 2011, and blah 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 blah. I'm going to put in the comment section, but speaking about Popcorn, you know, say Gaza, always the center of attention. And, you know, Vibes Cartel, um, name got called up in um, whatever something, conversation with the correctional lady, Jai Stone. She was being, I guess, questioned by Antigua and they asked, so, you know, how prisoners like Cartel is, is making music behind things and things. You see me, I say, well, Cartel's lawyer has since responded. And he slammed the correction of facility people then, you know what I mean? In fact, he put the focus upon um, the rehabilitation programs in the prison because they mentioned Shakur um, was a part of the program and Cartel is not, you know what I mean? So he said that program doesn't do nothing to rehabilitate people more than put money in other um, prison pockets. It's because you know them profit from these you know what I mean? And he said, right now, Jack Hero is back in jail for attempted murder. You know what I'm saying? So and he's they should focus that, on rehabilitation um, and, 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 and the conditions in a jail. You see me? I say, boy, oh boy, oh boy. And I think he's exactly right, you know. Um, there's no craft market, there's no trade, there's no nothing, you know. The, the, uh, from Muta Baruka, Muta Baruka said the government take away all of the rehabilitation thing them for public people and uh, and the prison, you know what I mean? So, um, that's like giving that thing there, but the only good thing he said is that the lady said that Vibes Cartel is innocent um, till proven guilty, and that is the most important thing. I mean, I guess they are long for the cartel, always in other, uh, they, they, they mix with the government when it comes to things. All I'm saying is the man I've been a record from 2011 or since him gone at jail. I know, you know, I answer them things. Remember, so I can't tell that my father have big blood clad wire, you know. Yeah, I mean, remember Ron Connor and, 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 and brawling and all of them things that he said, man. So, I so I get an update while I go on with the Gaza people, them, you see me. Anyway, me don't want long out that one year any longer, you see me. So, my people, but don't forget to comment on this popcorn situation. I'm very eagerly interested in I um, mean, the outcome of this investigation. We know Bert Samuel's job is to make his client look good, whether he's bad or not. You see what I'm um, But if the JCF really put out cocaine charge business and not in Augusta, man, that, that little, that, 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 that germs that murdered that mother and her four kids might get money uh, for the government too cause you know so them leak film um medical examination you see me I say? so i be a slackness i go on you see me you know what i mean don't forget to like share subscribe and hit the notification bell to be notified when i drop the latest in the dance hall news musical reviews and gossip and don't forget to comment upon the amari um situation and the vibes cartel situation as well 
You see me, I say, share the video and the link on our social media platform.